Hi, beautiful Pisces. It's Bella Katrina here. It's the new moon energy I'm harnessing to do a love, romance, moon cycle reading for you. So I've called in the romance angels and I hope you've had a good month. And I know the last two weeks have been topsy-turvy for most, but it's been a few more weeks for Pisces. Do you know what I mean? Topsy-turvy. So really being tossed around a little bit, especially mentally, emotionally fragile. You know, I feel good some days and then other days not so good. Picking up on everybody's energy because the dark forces are down here. And I've seen more dark energy in the last six months or probably six weeks than I've ever imagined would be possible, let alone seen. So clearing your energy, laying on Gaia and actually saying no. Ah, imagine a Pisces saying no. N-O. So that's just when you just say no to everything. And then if you know, if you get, if you get that you'll, get a sign you'll get your guidance if you're grounded and you say no to something that you're meant to do your guidance will step in 30 seconds later so then you're much more relaxed you know because you know you're grounded and you're going to get your guidance i'm going to offer you the free upgrade so i have been offering it to youtube channel clients for your first just telling you what I offer, a power shabam. It's two hours, we connect to your spiritual team, we find out who's involved, who's with you to guide you at the moment. I work closely with the Ascended Masters and the Archangels and I have new galactic beings of light coming in and Venusians, Palladians, Arcturians. So star seeds, um, I'm here to connect with you Blu-rays and Twin Flames. But you get two hours one-on-one -on -one with me to clear, balance, ground, and protect your energy. We do snapshots, snapshot readings, questions, romance, life purpose, and guardian angels, spirit guides, and loved ones who've passed over. So take advantage of that. If you're interested in a reading or you need to feel better, you get it all. So you get mediumship, tarot, snapshots, angels, and Reiki, because I'm proficient in it. And we do it on FaceTime or Skype. You'd love it. So, you know, shout your mum one. Because if anyone's in disease or in, you know, that's just the body not being able to flow the energy through. And disease actually occurs outside, so it's had permission to come in. So if you know of anybody who would benefit from Reiki or healing, let them know and I'll offer them. Pisces friends as well. Look, Pisces, there you are, darling, look. So I know you can say, oh, I'm a guy watching this. But, you know, that's your partner. That's the one you want. So we haven't left you out. You're here too because that's your date. So, Pisces, love you. Pause and observe. Let's have a little quick snapshot. I'm just going to do a seven-card layout. It's like an aerial view of the energy of Pisces around this full moon going into the whole cycle. So we're looking at the whole month and our focus is on romance and love. So you've been having a good look around, right? This is you having a good look around in the past. Mmm, what's he doing now? What's she up to? Oh, I don't know about that. Oh, I like talking to them. Oh, I like him. Oh, I don't mind her. It's a bit like that, you know? You're pausing and having a look. Because once you're swept up in somebody else's energy, it's hard for you to detach and discern their character. So before you fall in love, it's good to just step back and have a look at that person, how they treat other people, their family, or even strangers, you know, whether they're polite or caring, and if they care about your feelings. So this is you having a good look. The energy is much better now than it was on the last reading. So... Um, I'm just going to go straight down the middle here. They're showing me right down the middle here. This is new contracts. So you've been signing new contracts and it's been good. And things are going to start shifting and moving forward. So that's like signing the contract, then starting the job in two weeks, and then saying goodbye. So there's something new coming in and it's on paper and you sign it and you're happy about it and it does get the ball rolling. So there needs to be a change here even of home. 
as well. Get change of home or clearing the clutter in the home. But Pisces, we wouldn't have any clutter anywhere. Who are you talking to? So here's um, the man of the house, if you like, or the um, person that you need to get advice from. So there might be something legal here that you've signed a document or you're looking at childcare. Um, childcare. You know, money. Child money. And or other things. <coughs> Excuse me, to keep things going. It seems to keep things going. This is major though, because it seems heavy to keep it all afloat. It's like going and asking somebody for a loan because you need the money. It's a bit like that. So you need to put those, even though it's happening as a friend or whatever, or it needs, still needs to be on paper and signed. You know, because Chinese whispers, and then people start believing their own Chinese whispers. Here down the middle, it's done to help you. But you need to put it in writing, okay? Remember, put it in writing. Now, the energy around you and the people around you, see, things are moving. So we're going to do three cards on here because this is your action, purposeful action to take in the next 30 days to create this love and romance, right? Feeling happy, very magnetic, right? Or looking good with this hot chick on your side, gentlemen. So these are the three things we're going to have a look at because this is your out. This is your outcome. So the next two weeks, you need to really focus, right? And read fine print. Trust your gut. If you don't feel like going to a meeting, you don't feel like signing something, do not be pressured into it. They're saying bide your time if you feel like it or make it earlier so that you can have your holiday at that time because you, it's like you've got to make things to suit you. I still get that you need to put yourself first and be very assertive here because otherwise you might have to wait um, and not go on a holiday because you have to sign this thing that you didn't change it because you weren't being assertive. It's annoying. So just be very assertive or ask this guy. He'll help you be assertive. This guy. Who's he? So this is beautiful energy. I get really um, caring, nurturing, knowledgeable and kind so this person's coming in to help you Pisces so please accept help slow down and relax and know that help is on its way and the Emperor is sort of a bit you know is kind so it's a bit sexy it's a bit sexy this kindness <laughs> the Emperor's got sexy kindness going on and you like that because kindness is rare in um, people I find these days so this is success this is you going actually you know what I love my home I love my kids I love my man and I love those petunias I planted and look at them sprouting and we've got new goldfish do you know what I mean it's like loving where you are and blooming where you're planted <laughs> blooming where you're planted that's a funny one for Pisces so the energy shifted. I just looked at the other card, but the energy shifted now. So this is looking good. Two weeks, remember, keep focus. Oh, we had to do the action. Sorry, that's why. One, two, three. I'm going to just pick three cards. Okay, so the action is nothing. Do nothing. <laughs> do nothing. It was funny. I went down to talk to the fairies and the angels and the sunshine out the backyard. And I was asking about a particular matter that I was very, very concerned about and stressed about. And I was saying, what do I need to do about it? Tell me, tell me, tell me. And I tried to calm my mind down and I tried to relax. And, and then I got, after about 15 minutes, I was like, because the more you need a miracle, the more you have to detach. So I thought I have to do this because I need help. And I got nothing. I'm like, no, I'm asking you. Don't tell me nothing, right? And then I was like laughing afterwards going, oh, do nothing, <laughs> do nothing. <laughs> I never thought of that, you know? So this is what this is. This is do nothing. Forget it. So life is going to come in and help you out, right? You don't know which way to go. You don't know what direction. You don't know what to choose. Choose nothing. Because once you say no, 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 no. These are your seven no's that it was talking about. No, 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 no. They go, oh, all right. We've learned, she's learned how to say no. He's learned how to say no. So you're learning how to say no. And then here comes yes, 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 yes. All at once. 
So there's a definite need to say no to something that doesn't serve you. That is your action, doing nothing, pausing and observing. See that, pausing and observing. So thinking, what do I need to do? What do I need to do? Nothing. They're saying, clear out your closet because you might have to pack your bag very soon to go on a spontaneity, spontaneity, spontaneous getaway. And it's just going to be tragic if you're still there four hours later going, where is that eyelash thing? I need that hairdryer. I thought it was under here. But if you're all organized, you'll be like, I'm all ready. I know exactly where the bag is because I just cleaned my room out. Thank goodness I did that. And then you're ready and you're off and you're racing and success is coming your way. Get this advice. Follow this advice from a male who cares for you and who is kind, you know? It's very kind. It's like having a neighbor who's the judge at the courthouse or the doctor or there's some information here for you. And it might be that, you know, it's a hot date with the vet or I just got a policeman pulling you over. But you wouldn't be pulled over, Pisces. So don't worry about that. But it'd be just you to go, we turned into a date because he was a hot copper okay enough of that we're going to do romance here with the romance angels for pisces just see what's coming in for them for this moon energy massive vibrant um, manifesting energy i get for the next three months so plant your feet on the ground pisces know that you're looking good here skippity doodah everything's coming do nothing do nothing because once you panic and you worry and then you think of things that you need to do and then afterwards you go, I wish I didn't do that because that wrecked everything. Okay. Well, slowed it down. It's not going to wreck everything. Attraction. You're very attractive. <coughs> so this is also about um, smelling good. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> got smell a tube. Smelling good. You like a good, nice smell, right? So you need to get some essential oil um, and, you know, even guys, you need to get the oil on. You get to the natural products, not this fake perfume crapola that's got demonic energy in it. That's why they're selling it so cheap. Remember, it was all expensive perfume and then it went cheap, cheap, cheap. And then every single singer had five things of perfume. It's because demonic energy can be carried in the water. So throw it out. Get some natural stuff. Now, it also is about here being in nature. Right? Nature is your healer and nature helps open you to love frequency. And you attract romantic love when you're enjoying the moment of nature. Right? Surrounding yourself with beauty and bringing nature indoors, plants inside. Flowers in vases, pick them in the street. <laughs> and it helps open, get rose essential oil on your heart chakra, I get. You know, put lavender on your pillows. Very, very nice. Because there, it's like a um, all senses attraction, you know. You want to smell good, you want to feel good, you want to look good. And you want to be able to accept help knowing that, you know, the past is over. In the past, there were struggles and un un unrequited love. Oh, unrequited love. But here, it's like, oh, well, I'm just going to smell this flower and I'm going to just fall in love with myself and the universe. And, oh, there you go. I attracted love. Or your partner has a shift. So if you need to do a um, prayer to the angels to ask your partner to have a shift in the heart chakra to open up to more intimacy, then um, do so. And we do all that in your shabam and find out exactly that. Because you shouldn't be without unconditional love and you shouldn't be without this intimacy that you crave and that you deserve and you, that you desire. So I love you, Pisces. Have a great month. Connect with me um, and get your free upgrade. You're $55 off. So you actually go into my website, Reiki by Bella. 
and you look up for availability under the power shabam. But when you purchase, you only purchase and pay for 90 minutes, but you get 120 minutes. Anyway, have a look under psychic readings, see what people are saying. Because once you have your shabam, it's amazing. It changes your life and you never know. It could just be what you need right now to set you up for fun and love and get you magnetic and attractive to divine partnership shine really bright pisces thank you for your insights your comments your questions for connecting with me for your thumbs upsies and um you know that's if you like it it's my life and um subscribing and i look forward to talking to you with that for our new moon wishes if i don't see you before i love you shine bright